This is code.org. I'm currently working on CS Fundamentals Express course. I'm on Lesson 5, Collecting Treasure with Laurel, Puzzle 12. Let's see what we have here. Look at the code carefully. What do you think will happen if this program runs? Ooh, a multiple choice. So, as a teacher, I can tell you, when you hit run, your answer is submitted and your teacher gets it. So let's talk through this and choose wisely. So, move forward, I would move forward one block. Collect, well that would be a problem because I would be standing here, what am I going to collect? Hmm. Yeah, right here, I think it's going to be B. I mean, right away, we move forward one and we try to collect. There's no treasure there. That would cause an error. Well, no, you're not going to collect the treasure, so how could it be C? D, I don't like. Well, you're not going to collect all the treasure. I mean, that's obvious. Look how many pieces. Yeah, it has to be B, because we look at this first step. We move forward one block, and then we're going to bend down and collect the treasure. Oh, wait a minute. What? Oh, no treasure. Let's try. Yep. Code's tricky, but it always runs in order, and hopefully it always runs the same way. All right, so got to just be very uh, particular about looking through it when we're writing code. Let's uh, keep going.